one day in, a, in Green Bay just to, to see the second largest plane in the world. A huge plane made a big landing at Austin Straubel International Airport today, carrying gigantic cargo headed for an area manufacturer. The Antonov 124 landed just before noon, and the Russian-made plane weighs nearly 200 tons. It's the largest aircraft ever to land in Green Bay. Fox Lens Kelly Schlick has a closer look at why it's here. Onlookers crowded around fences by Austin Straubel Airport eager to take in this massive sight. It's pretty amazing. I'd love a ride in it, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Antonov 124. Its wingspan, 240 feet. It's 226 feet long. And if it landed at Lambeau, it would nearly take up the entire football field. It is a very unique aircraft. It actually has two internal cranes inside the aircraft. Jet Air executives said they received a special request for the landing a few weeks ago. It's coming from Hahn, Germany. It's uh, unloading cargo going up to uh, Marinette, Wisconsin. Defense contractor Lockheed Martin says this heavy cargo will be part of the USS Milwaukee, a literal combat ship being built at Marinette Marine. The company tells Fox 11 these parts will help with the ship's propulsion. They needed a 100 ton crane. They needed three semis uh, and to get all those onto a ramp at a TSA airport and provide security at the same time was a huge issue. Before it could undergo the four hour unloading process, the Antonov 124's cargo had to be inspected by customs officials. They say it's unusual to see a shipment of this magnitude at the airport. Normally cargo into Green Bay comes via rail or ocean. Uh, whether or not the, uh, the cargo could have came in via ship if the lake was open, that could be, but uh, the cargo itself is too large to put on rail. After the parts are unloaded, the Antonov 124 will spend the night on the runway. Its crew will stay in a nearby hotel. Sunday morning, it'll take off, refueled with 45,000 gallons of jet fuel. That's a cost of roughly $143,000. Probably the biggest single fuel order ever in the history of Green Bay. After the behemoth departs, it's amazing. Yeah. amazing. This thing could actually fly. Those who saw the Antonov 124 land say they will likely remember it for years to come. Kelly Schlicht, Fox 11 News. An Antonov 124 once made an appearance at the EAA fly-in in Oshkosh. We have a photo gallery from today's plane landing at Austin Straubel Airport. Just head to our website, fox11online.com. Click on the photo gallery section on our homepage.